Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Home Dell is brought to you by Monmouth Medical Center in Long Branch. Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Manalapin is being brought to you by Ramapo College. We've got a great 7-10 quarterfinal matchup in the short conference round of 16. Manalapin travels to Home Dell. The Hornets an impressive 17-2 on the year. We saw some great scorers in this game. Nick Seeloach was locked in early. He hits the mid-range baseline jumper. Manalapin builds a lead in the first. Bill Perlman the hoop and the foul. Perlman was a force throughout. Then Aiden Sosanov spins. He finds a way to score. Sosanov with 16 for the night. Manalapin leads 15-10 at the end of one. Second quarter, Anthony Ledger Jr. just inside the three-point line. Ledger's got a great motor. He really fuels Manalapin as the Braves build a seven-point lead. Palmdale went inside to James Valillo. The Hornets closed the gap to close out the second at the half. Manalapin with a 29-26 lead. Third quarter, here's Ledger attacking the rim. He had a solid game with 16. Valillo was the hot hand for Homedale. He had 20, including this nice reverse. Manalapin puts together a run in the third. Ledger up ahead to Perlman. Phil Perlman has the Braves up eight. It's 48-40 with 1.39 to go in the quarter. The Hornets respond with a 7-0 run. CJ Karras on the drive. We head to the fourth quarter. Buckle up. It's a 48-47 game. The fourth quarter was great tournament basketball. Sosanov climbs the glass for the rejection. Man, that was awesome. Take another look. Aiden Sosanov pins it against the backboard. A tremendous defensive play. Homedale trailed for almost the entire game until Ben Kipnis dials in from three-point land. It's the Hornets in front, 52-51. The lead was short-lived. Manalpin answers right back. Perlman doing damage again from close range. 53-52, the Braves are back out in front. Crunch time was awesome. Back and forth we go. Seeloach inside ties the game at 54. Under a minute to go. Kipnis with the runner, banks it home. Ben Kipnis was clutch. 47 seconds to go, 56-54 Homedale. Manalapin has a response. Ledger takes it to the bucket. His shot is off, but Perlman's got the offensive rebound and put back. 26 seconds to go, we're tied at 56. Phil Perlman had 19. Now he would miss the free throw, but the Braves get the rebound and they've got a chance to win it. Ledger looks to be the hero. His shot off the mark. We've got overtime in Homedale, all tied up at 56. In OT, off the miss. Kipnis blocks the shot. Valillo up ahead to Seeloach. Nick Seeloach gives Homedale a 60 to 58 lead. He led all scorers with 24. Seeloach scored all five points for Homedale in OT. He goes one of two from the line late, so the Hornets' lead is two. Manalapin now looking for double OT. Ledger dishes to Sosanov. Manalapin is all over the glass. They get one look, two looks, three looks. It doesn't fall as the buzzer sounds. A heartbreaker for the Braves. Homedale survives. They're through to the short conference quarterfinals. 61 to 59 is your final. What a great game played by both teams. Homedale will face CBA in the final eight on Saturday. Nick Seeloach talks about tournament basketball and a gutsy win. I mean, it's always fun having games like this. Yeah, it's scary, but I mean, it was today's win means a lot. I mean, seven and ten. This just brings a lot of momentum going into the next game. Reporting from Homedale, I'm Rich Crampanis for JerseySportsZone.com.